In Mexico, Enrique Peña Nieto has reached the midpoint of his six-year presidential term. His may have started as a promising presidency, but currently he's suffering almost record low approval ratings. CCTV's Martin Markovitz reports. Mexican President Enrique Peña Nieto is close to passing the halfway point of his presidency, but his popularity has plummeted. In August, the Mexican polling firm Consulta Mitovsky showed his approval rating at 36 percent, the lowest for a president in over 20 years. His government had a promising start with the passage of energy and telecommunication reforms that opened up state-controlled businesses to private investment. But his reputation may have taken a hit after his handling of the disappearance of 43 students, the escape of drug kingpin El Chapo Guzman, and a series of corruption scandals. For certain sectors that were in favor of pro-market reforms, his first two years were very successful, especially the first year. But legislating is not governing. He does not communicate really well, and he's isolated in a reality that most people are not in agreement with. People feel the economy is not strong, that security is weak, that there are widespread human rights abuses and corruption. Despite these issues, a central bank poll expects the economy to grow by more than 2 percent this year, better than most of Mexico's Latin American neighbors. But here in Mexico City's main square, the Zócalo, Almost all of the people we talk to are deeply critical of the president's performance so far. Hiberto Alvaro is a retired worker who feels the country's on the wrong path. The country's worse than ever. There's high unemployment, high crime levels, a lack of opportunity, not just for the young, but for everybody. But while most people have negative views, Ana Juarez, a businesswoman, believes the president had to make tough decisions, like the partial privatization of the state oil company Pemex, that, while unpopular, could generate benefits in the future. I think he has done what was necessary. It's not good or bad. He had to fix something that was broken. We are in the process of getting better, but we still have a long way to go. With Mexico's current problems, it may seem that President Peña Nieto's administration has little chance of changing public approval numbers. But with three years left in office, a possible turnaround could occur even though most Mexicans have little faith that this will happen. Martin Markovitz, CCTV, Mexico City.